So let's talk a little bit about slide design. I am in Keynote, which again is a program for a Mac or a PC, and I'm working on a presentation for social emotional learning. Now you'll notice that just looking at the slide, it looks okay, but one of the things that I notice is that my white text on kind of a lighter background just sort of looks a little flat. It doesn't really stand out, and I'd like that text to stand out a little bit more. So I'm gonna show you two different ways that you can do that that will take about two seconds. It's really easy. So what you can do is just double click on your text like this and it brings up our inspector right over here to the right. We're going to choose the sub menu that says text. And then right over here, you'll notice this gear, it will show you advanced options for your text. So the first thing that you can do from this menu is you can drop a shadow. So I'm going to check shadow. Okay, and now you'll notice that when I do this, let's bring this back again, here's how it looks without the shadow. Here's how it looks with the shadow. You can see it kind of stands out a little bit more. And what you can do uh, once you have that option clicked is you can kind of play around with the direction of the shadow so you get it the way that you want. There's also some different ways that you can play with some of the different um, different options for your shadow to make your text stand out a little bit more. So let me turn that off again and let me turn it on. It didn't keep the settings that I just had a second ago, but you can see you can play around with it and it will make your text stand out a little bit better. This is really helpful if you have light text on a light background. Okay, so let me take my subtitle right underneath here. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to click on that, move over to text, choose our advanced option and rather than doing shadow I'm going to choose this first option outline okay and there we go you'll notice that it will show an outline around each of my letters now this tends to work a lot better for thicker fonts if you look at this font right up here you can see that the letters are much more thick which means there's more space for that outline this is sort of a thin text, which you'd probably see in, in, in the, the body of a document, that kind of thing. So, so there's not as much space for an outline, so it looks a little bit thin. But if I go back to my advanced options, you can, again, play around with this. You can make it kind of a thick outline like that, or you can sort of just play around with some of those settings to adjust it the way that you want it to look. Okay, um, so I'm going to turn that off just to show you what it looks like with the outline and without the outline. And let's go back here to our title, advanced options again. I'm going to turn off our shadow. I just want to show you a little bit how the outline will work. So you can see I just have the same outline on the title as I had in that subtitle below. But you'll notice that it looks a little bit different because the text is thicker. It supports the outline a lot better. So maybe I want to keep the outline on here. And I can even change the color if I would like. And for this thinner for this thinner font, I'm just going to go up, choose my advanced options. I'll drop the shadow maybe for this thinner font. And again, this is something that I would have to go through and, and play around and get this right. So let's take a look at my before. Here's how my slide looks without the shadow or the outline. And then Here's my after. You'll notice that there's the shadow and there is the outline. So again, those are two advanced text, text options. If you have some text on the slide that doesn't seem to stand out very much, you may try either dropping a shadow or adding an outline.